thank you for joining me on this beautiful Texas morning. We are at 3513 Aubrey Catherine Drive in the Yale Ranch Estates this morning to show you a home that literally has everything you could want in a home. Exterior is done in this beautiful uh, limestone and brick combination, carriage style, two car garage with opener. So let's walk up and get you going. As we enter, this is a really unusual floor plan. So it's a split floor plan. As we enter right off the front here are two minor bedrooms. I say minor, but they're absolutely gigantic. Every room in this house is really nicely sized. Every, room, every bedroom has a walk-in closet. All of the windows have the two inch plantation blinds. So that's bedroom number one on the first floor and bedroom number two on the first floor. And in the, share, in the hallway that shares these two bedrooms, you also have a full bath. We've got three full baths and a guest, guest bath in this home. So shower tub combination, commode, and straight ahead there is our linen. I also wanna mention that all the doors in this home have been upgraded to these carriage style doors. So really pretty. All right, back out into that hallway. There's our front door. Back out into the entryway, this is our foyer. And I wanna show you a couple things here. So we've got this gorgeous art shelf. And then looking straight up, we've got a recessed coffered ceiling really tall ceilings throughout this entire first floor. Guest closet right here at the end of our foyer. And so now we're gonna go around the corner and I'm gonna show you the great room. And when I say great room, this room, this is a combination of dining and living and it's enormous. Some beautiful rounded transitions from room to room to give you that idea of separation, but not walls. This room was a bonus room on the floor plan and the homeowners here have chosen to use it as dining and kind of a little library area, but you can see that's actually large enough for formal living, huge dining room set if that's how you choose to use it, office, game room, library, and then into the living room area. Beautiful. The lighting in this entire home is gorgeous. So again, all of the windows have the two-inch plantation blinds beautiful lighting nice big living room let me show you from the other side that door on the other on the side of the living room takes you out to an extended patio in the backyard and then let me show you the living room from this side again tall ceilings throughout the entire first floor nice big that's really big furniture so that's a nice big living room area and then I'll give you a little bit different shot into that dining room and back out to that front door all right back out towards the front of the home and into the kitchen area. Great big kitchen. So we've got a center island that does have additional electric and countertop space. Gorgeous granite countertops. Let me give you a close up of that. Really beautiful. Ceramic tile on the backsplash and then some really pretty uh, glass tiles there in kind of a mosaic pattern behind your flat surface range. Double stainless steel sink, double ovens. And those are both ovens. Our microwave is over here, so those are both ovens. And then we do have a dining room area that doesn't have a dining room set in it, but even this dining area is plenty large enough for an eight-piece service. And then right off that dining room is the utility room and entrance to the garage. So I'll give you a view of the kitchen from this side. Really stunning. That uh, breakfast bar does partially wrap around the kitchen and looks right into that living room area. And so really it is a great room style home, just tied together so beautifully. All right, out of the kitchen, around the corner and into our master suite, which does sit here all by itself on its own hallway. And look at this, deep coffered ceiling, tall ceilings, great big master. This is really large furniture and that is I'm sure a king size bed. So really large space. And then into our master bath. Again, I wanna show you those carriage dial doors throughout. Master has linen closet, separate commode area. You can get a little picture of me there. Dual sinks, deep soaking tub, and then glassed shower area. So five piece master bath back out into our master. And again, I wanna show you the enormity of this space. All of the bedrooms have ceiling fans. All of the bedrooms have the shaved, shaved Berber carpeting. 
This is an enormous walk-in closet, which we'll have pictures for you on the website at johnrider.com. That's J-O-H-N-R-E-I-D-E-R.com. And don't forget, you can apply for this home anywhere in the world. All right, I'm gonna take you just one more quick peek this way back into the kitchen and we're gonna to go to the second floor. Prepare to be amazed. I'm sorry, I don't know that I got that refrigerator in the video, so side-by-side -side refrigerator with indoor ice and water and then a separate pantry. It would be easy to miss something in this house because there is so much to see. So we're gonna go right up to the second floor And as we get to the top of the steps on the second floor, this is another bedroom. So this is our fourth bedroom or third minor bedroom. And look at the size of this. Enormous. Tall ceilings continue on to the second floor. Again, those two inch plantation blinds up here. And I'm sorry, I think I said every bedroom has a ceiling fan. This one does not. And then into our loft area. And look at the size of this space. So they're using it as a game room on this side and office, and again, look at that lighting. You don't ever see spaces this bright on a second floor, but thanks to all the windows, this one really does have amazing lighting. All right, so now, the piece de la resistance, this is the media room. So super large, done in kind of an art deco, really fun media room. It is carpeted. And it's purposely dark in here, but I want to get you up a little bit closer and you can see that this is kind of a, a royal purple wall color. And then that really cool down lighting. Back out into our loft area. And then I'm going to show you our third full bath. So this is our guest bath. It does have a shower tub combination. Great space. So this actually could be a standalone uh, guest area as well because it's bed, full bed. Uh, excuse me, spare bedroom and full bath upstairs as well. Give you one more view from this side. All right, that concludes our tour. Um, if I didn't mention in the beginning, this is a 31 square foot, four bedroom, three and a half baths with a bonus media room. Thanks for.